What's up, do it yourself groupies? Today we got a one of them electronic mirrors on a Ford Econoline van. I'm gonna show you how to take it apart. Number one, you want to get yourself an interchangeable screwdriver like this one right here. It's a ratcheting 19 in one by Michael Pro. And we're gonna get inside our door here and start taking her apart. Got this little piece right here that we need to go ahead and pry off here, which you just barely stick your screwdriver in between it there. Get you a grip on it and pull it back, and it should pop that clip right out. As you can see right here, it's the only little clip that holds it in place. And you're gonna have four of these 7 16 or 11 millimeter fasteners right here, but you're not worried about them quite yet. And you flat tip around to the four way Phillips number two. Come up here to the top, go ahead and start taking this screw out. Got a screw right here behind the handle it needs took out. Bottom left hand side of the door, you'll see yourself a screw right here. Flip her back around to the flat head. Little cutout right there. It's a little flat slotted cutout. Get her screwdriver in there and just kind of pry up on it a little bit. Then once you pop up on it, you hear the latch click because the latch is right here underneath it. You're basically pushing in so you can detach that. Kind of set it up here out of the way. You're gonna come down here on this part of your handle. You'll see this little flat groove right here. You just kind of pull back on it. Slowly pull it out. Go back on the handle. And right here you go. Switch back to your four way. Right in here behind the handle, you'll see this metal brace, and that goes to the actual door itself. So you go ahead and start loosening it up. Once that was out, you come back over here to this side, four way right there, and you get it loosened up and took out. Once that's out, you're basically gonna pick up on your door here, detach it, turn this sideways, put it down through here. Right there you go, it pops it loose. Every take these off, there's gonna be these hangers right down through here that's gonna sit down inside there. So whenever you put it back on, you're gonna raise it up, push it inside the holes, push down on it, and your screw holes up. That's done, you got your speaker over here, so all you gotta do is go ahead and take your little pro or whatever you got, get your torques out, go ahead and put your Phillips in there, put your cap back on it. Should be a T20 on this, and then you go ahead and take these four screws out. And you grab your speaker, you kind of pop it out and set it to the side. Now if you look inside the hole where the speaker is, you should be able to see the plug, and that is the plug that plugs up your electronic mirror. Back on it, pop it loose because it's probably tie strapped in there. Pull back on this latch right here, and then you pull out on that plug. So she's unplugged, you just got to get these 7 16 fasteners off here. So you take yourself a little quarter inch ratchet right here and go ahead and put it on the fastener. Go ahead and loosen up the bottom all the way to the top. When you get down to the last fastener right here, you can be loosening it up while reaching your hand through the window and holding the mirror and it'll pull it right out. There you go. As you can see here, we're matching up this used one that we picked up versus this old one that they, they busted and they got some kind of flex mirror put on it. If it works, it works, I guess. Now all you gotta do to reassemble this is do the opposite of what you did to take it apart. Hopefully this basic do-it-yourself video that I rushed through will help you out. It's not that hard. Trust me, you can do it. All you need is the right tools. 